Hi everybody, it's your old pal Chuck, I'm back once again with a special review. No, we're not taking a look at the Transformers again. Today we're taking a look at a Renegade. This is from the G.I. Joe 30th Anniversary line, and it's a uh, Renegade's Duke. He comes with a gas mask, laser rifle, a whole bunch of pistols, which we'll get to in a minute. Here's his file card. A little bit of a glare there because of the nice gloss. But let's get to the figure. What a figure he is. As you can see, um, he does look close to his animated version without the, um, you know, angular designs. Um, he does come with several pistols, but only the one in his hand right here has the clip that allows it to peg into his leg. So basically, if you lose... Like so. Basically, if you lose that clip, um, that, sorry, that gun, you're basically going to have a duke that will permanently have a hole in his leg. One thing also I do want to point out that has been mentioned in several online reviews is the wrists. As you can see, they're using what is believed to be the Wave 1 J Shooter Cobra Jungle Duke arms and they've created new hands for with the um, additional wrist articulation. This unfortunately causes the wrist to bulge. It doesn't show up um, that well in the video, but I think you can see it better on this hand, but it's there. Um, other than that, he does have the basic articulation, head swivel, the extra wrist, the arms, um, ankles can pivot back and forth. It is somewhat hindered by the um, long pants cuffs. One thing I do enjoy, and I do want to draw your attention to, is the head sculpt. This is actually a very nice sculpt of a young Duke head. Um, so if you've ever been wanting to have a younger looking Duke, you know, his earlier days in the service before he was in G.I. Joe, there you go. Um, if you see this figure, you can pick him up. A lot of people consider him like one of the best Dukes ever. I'm not going to go that far, but he's a solid figure. This is your old pal Chuck, and I'll see you next time.